Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Blasted Oasis. So, I was not able to get into the mines last night. Too much work to do up here. Uh, knocking some blocks out, things like that. So, we're at the end of our sand. But I don't think we really need that much more. I'm going to leave this stuff here now. Uh, stone can stay in here. Rebar can stay in here because we don't need it downstairs now. Just got a couple of more blocks we need to update. So, I'll just show you kind of what I did here. Uh, not a lot. So I got these upgraded. Um, I got the plate and the post in on this side and on this side. Uh, I had the rock wrong block in the corner, so I updated that and added these guys in up here. So the inside is done. I took out the, the uh, corner block here, the quarter corner block, and put in posts. Just so that it's a, we can get in a little easier in the corners here. Added a post in the inside as well. Just kind of waiting for these to dry so I can update them. And then uh, let's update this guy too. Just so the birds don't hit it. And then this bar on the outside here all the way around. I made it steel on all three sides. Uh, that way, like this is the, this is the oh shit bar. Uh, so there's two blocks here. If they break through both of those. They still need to break through this oh shit block to get on the inside. Same thing down here. If they break through this block, they still need to get, like they can't get up and over this these two blocks. They have to knock these two out as well. Uh, dogs, spider monkeys and stuff cannot get through here. Uh, so these are the old shit blocks, which is why I upgraded this one on the outside here. Uh, we probably won't have to worry about it tonight, but um, it is uh, ready to go. Now I want to make sure I get these last two blocks updated before we leave. So, how much concrete do I got left? 132. Uh, let's update these guys. Now, these ones are probably going to end up coming out of here. The power blocks are fine. I should probably update any roof blocks here. And, well, we got cobblestone. We already got cobblestone to repair that. Um, just so that the vultures don't break their way through. I don't think, I don't expect them to. Um, I'm really not that worried about vultures tonight. Like I said, it's really the zombies on the on the outside that I'm more worried about. So we got six blocks to, we can update here. So I need to save two for outside. So one, two, three. Are these guys ready yet? No. I wish you could get like a heat lamp that could just like heat these up quicker. So I got three left. So we should do this block here, which is not updated, and then these two corners. All right, when I get those updated, we'll hop on the bike, and then we're going to head out and try to pull off a job today. Okay, so I dropped everything in this little chest here. Uh, so when we come back, we can just grab it all and get right into the horde, just in case we get back late. Now, are these done yet? Okay, that one's done. That's not, that's not. Uh, come on, guys, hurry up. Okay, you know what? We don't have time to wait. We're gonna get out of here. We gotta get out of here now. Don't have time to wait for that last block to update. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave this stuff in here. Um, the cement. Now we got some more. Yep, nice. Um, I, I had to remember I had to make extra concrete because we're gonna need it for. Um, where's my shot? I let, took left, dropped all my shotgun ammo. I had to some, have some of it on me. Uh, we're going to need some concrete for repairs just in case. I doubt we'll need to repair, um, but we, we need it for just in, in there just in case. All right, let's see here where we got to go. There it is right here. Not very far. Okay, there's our barrel, and it should be just up here. Right here. Let's turn the bike around. I guess we're going in the back, but I want to leave this on the road out front here. Right? Is this house here? Looks like it. Ooh, okay. Going in this way? Let's wrench this car apart. Only because we need as much gas as we can get. If we can do these missions that have cars and double wrench them, it's definitely going to help us out in the long run. Now I put another 1,500 liters of gas or 1,500 gas in the vehicle. That's, that was half of what we had. 
So, I mean, we really need to get a steady stream of gas or we're going to be on foot again. Either that or we're going to be going back to the mini bike. And I guess we got to really have like atom junkies. Okay, so this is a fetch and clear. <laughs> Loud and proud, baby. Nice. I'm only going to grab the important things here. And let's wrench you. Okay, anything in here? Got 20 rounds. Ooh, concrete, definitely want to take that. Or cement, I mean. Take that. Might as well take this too. Oh, there's some cement behind here anyway. Perfect. What's up, motherfucker? Hey, hey, no, 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 no. Still giggling, even with no head. The headless giggler. Let's grab that. Yeah, fuck going in here quiet. Don't need those. Anything in there? Ooh, some water. Take that. Gotta break this apart. Pipes, lead. Go ahead and use that. Pipes, lead, brass. Beautiful. Need the pipes for pipe bombs. Damn it, she got a piece of me. I thought I was being stealthy, guess not. <laughs> stealthy shotgun. We need a, uh, we need to go ahead and get a, what's it called? Um, a silencer for our shotgun. Not exactly sure how that would work, but we'll go ahead and do it. Maybe, maybe we put it right up against the side of a zombie head and pull the trigger, that might help. Might keep it quiet for a bit, anyway. Alright, I'm just looking for food at this point. Go ahead and scrap this. That and any kind of, uh... Nitrate powder we can get here. Alright, let's grab this. Should've stayed in there. Should have stayed in there. Okay, med pot. Well, at least we found our uh, thing here. Let's grab that. Can we get that? We can now. All right, what do we got here? Some more water. Okay, let's just loot this quick kitchen real quick here. Well, I was really hoping for more nitrate powder, but uh Okay, we don't need you guys. Um I don't even know why I bother. Just drop it. We got tons of uh, paint at home, so don't have to worry about it. Well, he was feral. Not anymore. Go ahead and scrap you. Um, just scrap that.
Pushing your luck, girl. Pushing your luck. All right. Grab this stuff. Going through loud like this, it just makes it easier to uh, do more in a day, I guess. Aim for the head of the man is dead. <laughs> Wonder if I can Yeah, I should really wait for them to get close. I think I've got that uh, mod that gives me that high dismember chance within a certain number of feet. Oh, there's six rounds back. Okay. Nothing. Sleep on the job, man. <laughs> Wonder if he was hired for security. Not a very secure, uh, not a very secure place with a security guard like that. All right, <laughs> let's see what we got here. Ooh, bag. Now this was. The hallway, okay. Nothing out there. Ooh, gun safe, that's nice. if you're feral. Nope. Got Where are these guys? Oh, they're up here. Uh No door in that bathroom, huh? Um, who does a landmine there too? Well, let's wake him up. I was really hoping somebody would land that. Oh, okay. My wish came true. I was like, I wish somebody would land on that landmine. Thank you. Thank you very much. Paper. Meh. Really? Okay, I guess that's the way up. Take this. Nothing. Alright, we can sell that. Man, there's like really nothing here. Okay, well, we get a little bit from that. Ooh. Yeah, not as good as I thought it was gonna be. Let's see what we got here. Nothing. Okay, Shaka Messiah. Ah, uh, really? 
Uh, scrap you. Well, actually, you know what? We can use that pocket mod. Do we have anything without? Okay. Put you on the feet. That's a little better, I guess. Come on, give me a triple pocket mod. Nope. Go ahead and scrap that, though. Now ah, we got 16 rounds back. Hopefully we get something good in here. I keep thinking I've got, like, my um, encumbered spots fully free, but you know what? I keep forgetting we've got the um, the double storage pocket mod uh, schematic at home. So we can go ahead and use that. There's nothing else up here, huh? Nothing else behind here? Ah, well, okay. That's kind of a bust. We got everybody though, right? Yeah, return to trader. Alright. Alright, let's take this bed apart. And I might as well try and... Oh, yeah, this gun safe. Forgot about that. Alright, well, we broke two lockpicks, so it's not so bad. Ooh, that's not too bad. We can carry all that, right? We got a grenade. I think we should be, uh... Carrying grenades rather than dynamite. Okay, that's not so bad. Now, uh... Mechanical parts, we've already got in our inventory, right? Yeah, take those. Anything else in here? This has got brass and electrical parts. Grab that. Or grab brass and iron, eh? Okay. So we were just in there. Now, um, let's wrench the sink in here. I want to see how much, if we can get more out of it by wrenching it. Yeah, not really. Not really. Okay, well, not spending any more time here. Let's get out of here. Okay, we got a bit of time. So what I want to do on the way home here... Actually, let's put some stuff in the bike here. Uh, stuff that I know we're going to sell, but stuff that we're not going to repair. Uh, that we can sell, that we can sell. Uh, what else we got here? These parts. Okay, cool. Because I want to do some stuff here. I'm going to go ahead and grab this guy. Okay, now let's wrench this car apart, get it off the road. Alright, we're just leaving a pumpkin seed behind, so we don't need that. Alright, Hugh, you better got something good for us. Anything in here? Hackers. Alright, let's just sell some GAC first. Um, let's go back to the bike for a second. I think I want to put in stuff that we need to fix to keep it gassed up. So we need to fix you. Let's bring out the parts. We can just sell those now. Actually, you know what? No. We'll s we're going to sell them on another day. So we don't need any of those on us. Do we want any of this? No, we got the hackers. Uh, okay. Gonna buy another one of these hackers, which without any money, but whatever. I guess we're not gonna buy it then. I never would have guessed you. Ooh, steel spear. You did. 868. 860. 602. I wonder which one would go up faster with a mod in it. Like if I bought the steel spear, because it's level four, and this one's level three, I wonder if putting something in this would give it more money, like a mod. I don't know. Let's just take it. Anything out? Fetch to the northeast. I've got a job for you, if you like Old ranch house. Let's throw that in the slot for now. I think you're gonna need it. Uh, we could actually probably pull it off right now, but I'm not going to. So, I'm gonna hold on to you. Let's just sell these two off here for now. So we got 2200. Anything else we want out of this guy? Um, I don't think so. 
Like, we bought all his ammo, right? Yeah. He's got shotgun slugs. I don't really want the slugs, though. Could buy the 7.62. Sure. It's pricey, but whatever. Are we done here? We are. All right, hackers. And the health bar, probably. Eh. It's a tough choice, but yeah. Let's go with that. Alright, let's get home. Okay, I'm gonna bring everything inside. Uh, and then we'll get ready for the horde. Okay, that's it for putting stuff away. Um, what do we need to make here? We need to make... Let's grab you, grab you, grab you, and you. We need to make double storage pockets. Wait, what are we missing here? Duct tape. Oh, sewing kits. Lots of those. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and make three of these guys. That'll give us three more slots. That's nice. Put those guys away. And is there anything else we needed to make? I don't think so. Do we have a skill point? Oh, we're almost at a point where we can get a skill point. Let's grab you two and my emergency concrete that we just got. Nice. So let's go downstairs and see if that... That's still not solid yet. How many episodes is that now? It's ridiculous. We're still waiting for this one thing over here to dry. And that's it. Everything else has been ready to, is ready to go. Uh, I'm not going to bother fixing that. That's all blocked in. That's all blocked in. We're going to have repair stuff for that. Yeah, we're good to go. Don't have to do anything down here. The only terrible thing will be is if they don't attack that part. I can't see them not doing it, though. All right, we got one. All right. Um, start out with you. Oops, not you. Um, where are you? Here. All right, freeze up one more slot. Uh, it's unfortunate that these um, pockets don't actually uh, add anything to the cost of, of stuff when you sell it. I really wish it would, but whatever. Like even a clothing, like add a little bit, you know? Like 10% or something to the value of the clothing. Okay, so there's another slot that's free. And you can go in there. Now, did I have... Yeah, I got stuff going in here. I wonder if I should just melt the rest of my stone. And I was almost almost right on that one. Actually, I was right. I left one extra. I left one out. Uh, let's hang on to that though. Let's melt a couple hundred more. We'll make this into 311 sand. Actually, 300. 300 sand. Split that up, and that's um, don't think it's that much, but I'm gonna I'll put six in. I don't want to think about it right now. All right, uh, that's almost done. The last pocket done. I'm sure I'm forgetting something. Okay, modify you. So that's going to change our movement when we're. Uh, looting stuff. Uh, okay, so that's all that in there. I don't need any of that on me. I need one of these for the end of the night. Um, okay, let's drop some stuff off that we're going to not need here. Put it at the bottom of here. So we don't need you. Don't need you. Not going to need you. We're not going to need you. I'm going to hang on to that just in case. We've got this. That's for bears, so we're not going to take that. I think I'm going to leave my bow here. Don't think I'm going to need the bow at all. I know I talked about maybe using it, but don't think we're not. I don't think we're going to. The shotgun's going to rule this this night. I think. Oops. Uh, that tool, just in case. Okay. Grab all those. 
Okay, splints. Put you at this end. So we can keep track of our shotgun ammo. Let's do it like this. That's a lot of shotgun ammo. And pipe bombs. Let's just put them all down here. Okay, that's stuff for repairs. Repairs. Don't need you on me. Those are just in case. That's for the end of the night. Okay, I think we're ready. I mean, you know what we should do? Uh, I gotta worry about cops too, right? So five of those should be enough. And then let's grab this guy. Right? We'll need this for the end of the night. We still only got plus three lo looting goggles, eh? Oh, you know what we need to do? Um, okay, that can go back in there. We need those for the end of the night. Let's reload this guy. It's a little slow reloading, but it's actually not bad. 118 rounds, we'll take that. Um, anything else we need? I don't think so. I mean, we could take Molotovs with us, but I don't think that's going to give us any advantage. Um, and we can always come back for more ammo if we need it. I mean, it's not like we're going very far. Uh, okay. I think we're ready. It's really going to be all shotgun tonight. Let's grab... going to be more than we're going to need. Let's just repair this before we start. Um, shotgun's got the extender, and, or the uh, the barrel extender and the choke. Okay, I think we're ready. A few hours before, let's get some food in us. So I'm going to go ahead and eat one of these guys. Use one of these guys before we start. And then I think we take... Let's take one of these guys with us, and then let's take take that. I think so. I think we go that route. Sure. Now all we gotta do is wait. And maybe wait for this block to, uh, dry so I can update it and hopefully it'll be dry again before Horde starts. But yeah, this is going to be so easy. Like, Well, not easy, but... And we may want to see, we may want to make that a flat block and then have it go out. Because they're going to come up, they're going to they're gonna hit the first wire, get electrocuted, right? I'm going to shoot them. If they make it past that one, they'll hit the second one. And then if the, like if there if there's a big group of them, you just step back and drop a pipe bomb into them, and that's it for them. Okay, well, I think we're ready. I think this needs to be closed tonight, just so they don't see breaking through the back walls is a better way to get to me. I don't think they will. Like I mean, for that matter, I could always put this up too, right? But I don't foresee them doing that. If they do, then we're going to go uh, go up on the roof and it'll be a pipe bomb fight, but then we'll have to figure out what to do after that. Come on, man. Dry already. Oh, uh, we got our... Okay, we've got enough to repair, right? Yeah, forged steel. Forged iron. We got to repair those guys from inside here. Right, okay. Okay. Do I sound nervous in my voice? I am a little bit, but... Because it is day 35. What game stage are we at right now? Um, so, let's just have a look at our skill points first, though. 3 into Perception, 2 into Demolitions Expert, so this gives us uh, plus 20% damage with uh, pipe bombs and stuff. Um, which is great. Uh, we don't have any Penetrator yet, but we will be getting that. Lucky Looter, Treasure Hunter, and Salvage Operations still... Strength, we got Boomstick up to level 3, which is good, because we're doing 30% more damage with this thing, which is awesome. I've been raising up Miner 69er and Motherload the past few 
few uh, levels because we need that for mining for sure to get as much stone as possible. Master Chef at level two, which is awesome. Um, then Fortitude, we've got a, at level three with two and a machine gunner for the AK or for the uh, M60 that is living off the land for our food upstairs. And then level one at archery, light armor and hidden strike. And then three and a better barter just giving us the, the good deals at the trader, which is awesome. 15% is pretty good, plus the trader's showing better stuff in their stash. It's awesome. Um, and then physician for making uh, the chem station and bandages and stuff. Advanced engineering. And then, yeah, motorcycle mechanic. We've already got our motorbikes. So we don't need to go up anymore in any of this stuff, I don't think. I don't think we're ever going to get to the... Uh, I mean, maybe it's a better idea to go to the uh, gyrocopter, but, you know, I can't fly that thing worth a damn. Alright, you know what? I'll see you guys when the horde gets here. Well, it's a beautiful sunset. Mother Nature never knew colors like that. Look at that. Well, it looks like the horde's about to start. Let's wander out the front door here. This block never did uh, dry. Okay, let's get the power on. So let's see how we're doing here. Power 55 watts, maximum output 150. So we're good. Okay, here we go. See where they're coming from. Here they come. Come on, you beautiful babies. That pipe bomb kind of ricocheted. I think I bounced off most most tummy. You see how it just drops down there, though. Yeah, the air is going off that's like crazy. I just love how just the pipe bombs just fall right in the trough. Like I said, this base is designed for pipe bombs. If you use grenades out there, you will take damage because you won't be far enough away from them. Yeah, this base is so much better with two levels of... of uh, of uh, much expense.
Now those pipe bombs won't be as effective against radiated zombies. Price is like popping this. That can't be it. Nope. They're just choosing a different side. Oh, the birds are getting wrecked. Okay, we got a cop somewhere out there. I think it was a cop. May have been a bird. So the idea behind the pipe bombs is they use a lot less uh, gunpowder, right? It's like 12 gunpowder. And you can kill a ton of zombies with it. But each shotgun round is four. If you're making your own ammo, it's just cheaper to use the pipe bomb. We've been lucky enough to buy it or or get it as a uh, uh, quest reward, so shotgun ammo has been pretty easy to get. So, so um, the penetrator is going to be important moving forward to be able to get through the zombie's armor. kind of drops down there, right? The pipe bomb. So that's 12 gunpowder. That went a bit too far because it didn't hit anybody. You gotta kind of aim it at a zombie. That way it hits them and bounces down. Like, I don't know how many we killed there. And once again, the, the uh, shotgun choke mod is essential for this because you're basically directing all of the damage from the shotgun into one location. I think that's it. I think that was just wave two. Can't be it. Yeah, I hear some running. I think they're around back now. Here they come. benefit too of having three or four sides to this space is that they're spreading the damage around right they're not focusing it on one location so you definitely need to repair less often but it does take more resources than a focus space
So if you misfire like that, not a big deal. You just step behind the pillar, that's what it's there for. Plus the zombies still take a bit of damage from it, so... I mean, you probably not enough to kill them, but they will take damage. Oh, we got a radiated spider monkey out there. We never did check our game stage. I meant to do that. We got into skills and then I forgot, so... Sorry about that. So, did the spider die or is he still there? Okay, you see what he does here? He can't get to you. It's so enjoyable to, to watch them lose out on the... on the... getting the short end of the stick for a change. Let it drop over. Let's we'll repair this while we got a break. So the interesting thing will be when demos show up. I'm interested to see how the base holds up against them. But then it will be all steel. The idea will be once they get electrocuted, just we just have a sniper rifle or something that go for their head with armor-piercing ammo. I'm really hoping that we can find the marksman rifle, or at least the schematic. Now we've gone about two thirds of the night and haven't needed to repair any of the electric fences yet. I think it's because they spread the damage out. Okay, there's the first one. I told that while I fixed this. Oops. There we go. I'm interested to see if I can get in. To fix it from here. I should be able to. Those aren't even damaged. Oops. Click. Now that might be it. Are these guys damaged? That one is. Yeah, I can get right in from there. Beautiful. Now what about these guys? No, he's cool. He's cool. I think that's it. These guys are full. Yeah. I think that's it now. So, I used 20 pipe bombs. And... Mm, almost three, well, 280 rounds of, of shotgun ammo. That's it. So that's actually really good, I think. Comparatively. Alright, let's go grab our loot. Looks like we got good stuff out here. Or at least a fair amount of it. Let's turn this off. And we used... We were down 5, so we used 18. No. 7. 17. 22 fuel. So nothing. The, I mean, the repairs will, will say it all, like how much damage we took on the building, like the walls and everything, but we'll see in a second here. So let's drop... most of the stuff in here. Right. I think we can probably drop that that and that. Let's go ahead and wear these and use this. Drop you in there. All right, let's see what we got here. Some steel. 
All right, a little bit of money. Crap, a little bit of ammo. Any ammo we get back will be nice. Military armor. Yeah, we didn't get that many bags, it looks like. Ooh, the gasoline schematic's gonna be nice too. I just thought of that. Ooh, level 6 AK. Okay. Wow, we really got ripped off. Oh, maybe we didn't. Desert Vulture schematic. That's the 44. Ooh, I think we're gonna be carrying that around with us for a while. Alright, let's see what we got. Okay. So we got the de Desert Vulture schematic. We're gonna ahead and use that. Figure out what we need to make take to make one of these and a level 6 AK. Oh, we got the uh Oh, that's a motor tool large tank mod schematic. I've never actually seen that before. That's the first time I've ever seen that. All right, so what do we got here? 1500, that can go in there. Motor tool parts, actually these two are going in there. You can go in there. Actually, we can just scrap you. We can just scrap you as well. Get more money for the parts. 1400. Um uh, Oh, the beer we need to keep. That we can sell. This we're going to keep. Actually, how good is it compared to... What do we have? Level 3 AK. Let's modify this guy. Pull these out. So this is 60 range damage with 26 rounds. Really? Why does it have to be such low rounds? Anyway, we'll drop these guys back in here. Maybe we change the uh, loadouts from now on when we go out of the house. Maybe we take the AK and we take the Desert Vulture and leave the shotgun here. Oh, I don't know. I'm really loving the shotgun, though. We got a tiny bit of ammo. 12 round, <laughs> twelve shotgun rounds. Oh, boy. Isn't that great? Um, motor... T okay, this is what? Motor tool parts? How many do we have? 29. Okay, we got tons. Okay, those guys can go in there. All right, well, we didn't make a lot of money, but we didn't spend a lot of money either. So it's not like, you know, I'm worried about the lack of stuff. Yeah, I gotta do something with this kitchen too. Maybe we need to spend an episode where we just like work on the house, because I think this place needs a lot of work. We gotta knock this out. We gotta, you know, we gotta put our drawbridge in there, fix the stairs. We gotta do all the floor, do all the walls, paint it all. Like, I've got a ton of paint now, right? We can just paint this place. The outside, we can paint it. So maybe what I'll do is I'll take like a day or something like that and just do like an episode where we work on the house. But that'll be for another time. I'm going to end this one here. Um, we'll pick it up probably in a couple of hours at this point. Um, and we're going to head off. I'm not going to worry about the base right now because it's really minimal damage. Uh, we're going to head off and uh, do the retrieve the supplies and then probably do the other one way out there for the other trader, wherever it is, um, and get those quests done. All right, so I'm going to leave this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Also, drop any comments in the comment section down below. I'd like to hear what you think about the base. Until next time, we'll see you later.